Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. This is Amanullah. You are watching my YouTube channel, Dr. Aman's video. Dear viewer, today in this video, we will learn about the difference between bacteremia and septicemia. So first of all, bacteremia. Bacteremia is the merely presence of bacteria inside the blood. And in bacteremia, bacteria can enter into the blood from any infection, any surgical procedure or from any harmless physical activity like a vigorous tooth brushing. And bacteremia usually do not result in the evident sign and symptoms or evident clinical manifestation. manifestation. Therefore, in case of bacteremia, the number of bacteria is very low and they do not multiply into the blood. Therefore, the immune system of a human body can easily eliminate these bacteria and bacteremia is in some cases bacteremia is a self resolved or a self limited condition while septicemia is a condition where the number of bacteria become increasing due to the active multiplication of bacteria into the blood therefore this active multiplication result in the production of byproduct enzymes and toxins which alter the physiology of the blood and results in the evident clinical manifestation or evident sign and symptom therefore you can say that septicemia is the more complicated form of bacteremia while bacteremia is a less complicated, usually self-resolved or self-limited and septicemia, is, septicemia can danger your life. Therefore, it needs early treatment and diagnosis. So bacteremia and septicemia are two relevant conditions but not similar condition. Therefore, bacteremia and septicemia are two different terms. Usually, they are used by some healthcare worker interchangeably, which is not good. Therefore, one should know about the demarcation or the difference between bacteremia and septicemia. Thank you so much for being with us for this concept. Fi amanillah.